today's show, we will be looking at how to save water in Ventura. Now we are going to go to an episode of Super Platypus Water Avenger. We are the water wasters! Fall weak to our water wasting powers. I have a sudden urge to waste water. 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 Our water wasting job is done. The water waster and the turtle. This looks like a job for. Super platypus! Professor Beaver! Let's go! It is us! Super platypus and Professor Beaver! It's a water conservation catastrophe and we're here to help! Thank you so much! You're welcome! Now I'm going to go turn off the faucet. It is important to remember to conserve water. You can do your part by not letting the faucet run unnecessarily. Don't be a water waster, be water wise. Okay, I will. My favorite part was um, filming everything and uh, being part of that, doing audio or doing cameras. I kind of liked all of it. I did camera, I did the I did editing, I did the control room, um, I mic'd people, and yeah. Um, I got to be a director and I got to work a lot of different things like cameras in the control room. Now we are going to talk with Shanna Epstein from Ventura Water. My name is Rebecca and we will be talking about the drought in California. Today we are joined by Shanna Epstein, the general manager of Ventura Water. Hello, Shanna. Hi. So what is Ventura Water? Ventura Water is the water and wastewater municipal utility for the city of Ventura, which basically means that we treat uh, water for you to drink and then we treat water after you've used it at your home or in your business and so and that's uh, we serve about 113,000 people. Wow that's a lot. So tell us about yourself. So um, I am Shauna Epstein and I uh, really got into water when I started in a management training program with Anaheim Public Utilities. Before that I didn't really know much about that industry um, and it was really a great opportunity to be through, go through that management and training program after my master's in public administration. Okay, so why are you interested in saving water? When did this passion begin? So this passion, I guess, really began when I started thinking about, after working in Anaheim, I worked for the city of Beverly Hills and really thinking about how um, all of these different utilities that we provide, either energy, water, um, uh, solid waste, all of these different types of utilities that we provide as cities many times, and so, sometimes it's private sector, we need to actually, we're doing, trying to protect resources in order to provide. And so that's really the passion that I got into of how water efficiency as being a part of a water utility's main mission. How long have we been in a drought? So we're going into our fifth year of a drought. Um, it's pretty significant and we don't know when we're getting out of it. So many people thought um, with El Nino that we would get rainfall here and we didn't get rainfall here. Northern California got rainfall so that helps many people in Southern California who get their water from Northern California but here in Ventura we don't. We get our water from Lake Casitas, uh, the Ventura River and groundwater. So how much water do we have? Do we know? Do we not know? We do know how much water we have. Um, and it changes based on the hydrology as well as regulations. Um, sometimes not only do we have um, a drought, but we also have regulations. So how, what's the right balance in the Ventura River? What will, um, so there's proper fish development as well as um, human use. So what can we do as citizens of Ventura to help? So there's many things you can do. You can use less water in your home and there's many ways of doing that. 
not letting the water run when you brush your teeth, taking shorter showers. But most importantly, if you live in a single family home, is just water two days a week. That really is where the significant amount of water use is. Um, now, if you want to water, we're offering different options. You can um, water two days a week with potable water, or you can sign up for our mobile reuse program and take a class and then bring reclaimed water to your home that's been, um, and use that water instead of using potable water. And that's a great way of using our different resources for the appropriate use. The other thing is we have an incentive program, WaterWise, and um, the new program's rolling out. And if you go to our website, you can get on the wait list and to get more information. But this allows you to replant your garden so that it, you're using water efficient materials and best practices soil and really keeping rain when it does rain, keeping rainwater on your property so that you use that water to irrigate versus um, potable water. And that's all the time we have for today. Thank you for coming in and giving us more information about a serious problem in our community. Thank you for having me. We, we can take shorter showers. We can um, use less water when gardening and washing stuff. We take short showers and don't leave like the faucet on when we're brushing our teeth and stuff like that. Okay, it is time for another episode of Super Platypus Water Avenger. We are the water wasters. Fall wheat to our water wasting powers. I have a sudden urge to waste water. I have a sudden urge to waste water. I have a sudden urge to waste water. It's another water conservation catastrophe. The sprinkler. Not that one. Oh, I'll go turn it off. It is important that we use water wisely. Try not to keep your sprinklers on for too long. Don't be a water waster, be water wise. Okay, I'll try better next time. Well, I learned how to work the cameras. I learned how to be on set manager and I learned how to do audio. I learned how to be manager and switching the cameras from camera to camera. And I learned how to do the teleprompter <laughs> and do the lights. Like I said, I learned how to use a camera. I learned how to act more. And I also learned how to be really funny. It is time for another episode of Super Platypus Water Avenger. We are the water wasters. Fall week to our water wasting powers. I have a sudden urge to waste water. 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 It's another water conservation catastrophe. It is important to not water needlessly. Also, be careful not to overwater your plants. Don't be a water waster, be water wise. Got it. Where is Super Platypus? It is I, Super Platypus, and your water wasting days are over. Dun, dun, dun. Wait, I'm not stupid platypus anymore. Anyway. Hey partner, I need your help. Time for action. Right. Uh, come on. We're gonna take you to a place you'll probably love. See him downtown. Yeah. No! I can't go back there! You'll enjoy it. It's pregnant. Now some words of wisdom from Professor Beaver. You should always try your best to conserve water. You can do help by taking shorter showers, turning off the faucet while you brush your teeth, 
and only using the water you really need. Don't be a water waster, be water wise. Hope you enjoyed the, enjoyed the show. Remember, don't be a water waster, be water wise. <laughs>